Hi Brad from WordPress Sites. I'm just going to show you how to make uh, your own unique WordPress theme using Artistair uh, in less than five minutes. First thing you'll need to do is download the free trial of Artistair. Uh, I have a link on my website wordpresssites.net. I've just written a, a very extensive blog post on the different uh, benefits of using Artistair and there's a link here you can download it. Once you've downloaded Artistair, uh, just click on the icon uh, for WordPress, click on WordPress, and we'll quickly uh, create a, a WordPress theme using Artistair. Now we've got a lot of suggestions that Artistair comes up with, so you can use the suggestion tab, uh, or, or you can make your own, uh, make your own decisions and, and uh, decide on which sort of template and colors you want to use. So uh, we just click on the suggestion tool and uh, we'll find a design that, uh, that we like as an example. And this, that one there is pretty good, so we'll go back to that one. Okay, now it's got uh, suggested backgrounds as well. We can click on that and that will change the background. Suggested sheet. Uh, you can see you can make the corners rounded, you can change the size of the, uh, the sheet. Uh, here we have the width. So if you're wanting a, a really large uh, website, you can, have, you can increase the size there, or you can decrease to 600. I, I, I think it's probably best um, to, to leave it around 600 uh, for, your, for your main content page. Uh, it's a lot easier to follow that way and it's a lot more focused, it's a bit like a landing page or a squeeze, a squeeze page, so it will be a lot more effective if you're an internet marketer and you want your readers to focus on the content. Uh, now let's look at the header here. Now you can easily upload your own header if you've had your own header designed, it's very, very simple. You just click on from file and, uh, and you just locate it on the computer wherever that is. So, uh, you may need to resize your header. Um, let's just take this as an example. This is not a header, but that's how easy it is to install a header. It's very, very simple. You can also put a picture of yourself, or uh, that there's, there's quite a few images here that you're allowed to use. So if you want to put a picture of, uh, of uh, a nice looking girl, you can easily uh, include that in your header. Uh, you can change the size of your header very easily as well. Okay, now let's go back to background. Uh, you can use your own background as well if you want. If you've got a background in mind that you're wanting to use, you just click on File and locate that on the computer, and, uh, and just add that as a background. So if you're wanting to make it a, a different color, you can choose any color from from the color palette here. Um, you can also uh, there's more colours down there, so it's very, very simple. You can put the hex code in here and you can just choose the colour of the background and click OK and that'll change it for you. So, so changing colours is, is very, very easy. Artist is extremely easy to use. It's very, very flexible as well. We've got fonts up here as well, uh, different colour schemes. Uh, you can easily change the fonts. Uh, there's the font sets here. Um, there's, there's a large range of different fonts, if you like Georgia around here. You, know, you just click on that and that'll automatically change your fonts. Uh, the typography as well, there's different types of typography. You can have a larger typography here, uh, font scale, and you can change the size as well. So it's very, very easy, it's quite easy to do. Just going down to the footer now, there's a lots of different options with the footer. It's, it's, it's very, very simple to change uh, the footer. Uh, you can change the footer text, you can change the footer colour. You want to make it a different colour, darker colour. Uh, you can very, very simply change the, uh, the colour of the footer. And it's like a, a blackish colour. Once you've finished designing your WordPress theme with Artistair, just click on export and, uh, and export it. Just export it to your desktop and then upload it as a, as a normal theme to your site.